Hello, the internet Saffron here, sitting at the pause screen because this is one scene that I haven't seen. One scene that I haven't seen. Uh, I know it was part of the flowchart progression that I was missing, so I didn't want to be talking over it. So we're going to get started here. And this is from way back. This is the reason why Carl unfortunately had to die in the very early chapters. So. We're gonna watch it. Very simple tombstone. Like no no epitaph or anything like that. Just just his name and the dates. I guess I don't even know what to say. You said I should never let anyone tell me who I was. But you didn't say that there was such a high price to pay for it. That freedom wasn't a gift, that it was a fight, but I don't know. Maybe that's what you were trying to tell me. I just wanted my people to be free. But instead, all I did was lead them to disaster. I am trying to find answers, but everything around me keeps falling apart. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? Help me, Carl. Please help me. Yeah. Oh. And he's wearing Connor's duds. Pretty much what it looks like. Interesting, Leo. All right, and then we're here, and this happens, you know, whichever chapter you take, you end up, because if Carl is still alive and you're on that correct path, you talk to Carl, or in this case, Carl. So, but yeah, and then you're back here, the church. Which just reminds me of the church from Final Fantasy VII. I'm sure people have seen that, where Eris is, the flower girl. Oh, and he's got the explosive. I don't know if I remember seeing that in previous playthroughs. Like, but, like, that must be an additional scene, because I don't recall that otherwise. All right, so now we can talk to somebody, to everybody, whoever's here. So there's Carl over here, and North is around, and I'm not going to bother with that. Um, then you get to decide what to do with Connor. Josh is over here. We're going to push this along, though. It's my fault the humans managed to locate Jericho. And I have done both paths here. I think this flow chart is like 100% complete. That's why I'm pushing through it. Sorry. I should have guessed they were. If you don't trust Connor, of us you shoot him in the head. Your place is just people. Uh, FYI. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. Yeah. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? And this, I believe, is the beginning of the last Connor, that's chapter. Suicide. It's so damn long. So we are going to try to split it up at points. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. Yes. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance. That is true unlikely also. Unlikely events to take place. Theory of large numbers. There's so many things happening and so many people that anything can happen at any given point in time. Okay. 
Oh, I guess I have to go apologize to Kara. Fine. I don't know why. Well, I guess he did tell her that she should stay. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting no, not really, because you remember you don't like her no more. Push her away because she's we Android. The last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Marcus. No pressure. Save our people. Okay, now that we did that, now we have a choice to make again. Or do I still have to talk to more? <sighs> I don't want to talk to everybody. I know what they're saying. <sighs> well, and that just a big kill fish. Fine, we'll talk to Josh. We'll talk to North. I didn't want to. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see Possibly. people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know that we're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide. Why does Marcus have five o'clock shadow? I'm with you, Marcus. Androids, girl beards. I know, I've talked about the hair and stuff before. It still bugs me. Alright? It just does. And talk to North. And look, it's Jerry! One of the Jerry's. What's your system status? I'm okay. Well, it didn't so hit she's fine. Components. I guess. You could have been killed trying to save me. Although she was limping, so... You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. But you are our people. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps. For extermination. We might have to change that. Hours, we're going to be the only ones left. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred? Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the Oh, well, that would still only be a few hundred, probably. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. In a few hours, it'll all be I mean, you think about it. Yeah, a few we'll hundred. Unless there's the thousands the hiding in the city. Us. It's still only going to be a few hundred. You have to make a choice, Marcus. I... Oh, it could choose, get into the many hundreds. We will follow you. I love you, Marcus. I guess it depends on how you define few. <gasps> Is that what's considered foreplay for androids? Android foreplay right in the middle of everybody. All right, now we need to stand up here and make another speechies. Marcus sure does like making the speechies. You likey speechy? Humans have That's decided. I doubt anybody. To I doubt anybody this. would understand the reference. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. Time what do we want to do? Choice. Well, we're gonna keep going on the pacifist One road. that very well may determine the future. Although the stuff that I wanted to do with people. Marcus is done. So honestly, anything I do now I know. with him is... Moving. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. Josh is happy about that. We are that. going to tell them peacefully North that we want justice. So any brownie points you if just... If there's any humanity in them, they will listen. Not that it matters. She's still... And if not... You know, unless you really mess it up, she still Others will take our place and continue this fight. 
Are you ready Yay, to because you converted us all. So yeah, we'll be more than happy to follow you. So yeah, so there's that flow chart. Oh, I do believe. Oh no. Oh no, what is this? I don't know what that is. Here I thought I'd be completing this flow chart because there's a paid respects up here. But no, there's this whole section here that I didn't get. I don't know how to get. I'm assuming something has to happen to Marcus in the previous chapter. Oh well, I guess then we'll just close the episode out with out here. I thought I'd have another flowchart completed. I don't. Yeah, what are you gonna do? So, but I'm gonna end the episode. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you all later. Bye.